We'll have to get out the door, but as we've been showing you all morning, the snow making that a little bit difficult today. Yeah, the roads are a little rough out there. Joining us on the phone this morning is Cassandra Bajak from the Indiana Department of Transportation. Good morning, Cassandra. Good morning. Uh, we always love to chat with you, but when we do, it usually means the weather is bad. And Northwest Indiana expected to catch the brunt of this snow that's falling a few more inches than over on this side of the lake. Uh, how are the roads looking right now? Yeah, so right now we're just seeing wet pavement conditions, but we're expecting that to kind of start taking a turn as the snow overcomes the pavement temperatures, and we're going to start seeing more slushy and snow-covered roadways as we go into the morning. Can you talk about the preparation for this as far as preparing the roads and, you know, the biggest time that you're expecting that you're really focusing on this morning? Yeah, so leading up to this, we were able to pre-treat the roadways. We had a pretty good heads up that this was coming. Um, and it's also kind of nice that the temperatures have stayed, you know, around freezing. So salt's going to be really effective. So we were able to make sure that we're all ready to go on that front as well. Um, and just really, you know, getting out there and taking care of the roadways ahead of time was really great for this particular event. Uh, we are expecting that conditions are going to be worse toward the south and the east, which is a little different for us even, um, not as bad along the lakefront. So if there's anyone going from the Chicagoland area, maybe to Indianapolis, they're going to start seeing the conditions actually get worse the closer they get to Indianapolis. Have you heard of any fatalities? I'm sorry, any, any traffic issues this morning? We've heard of a few, you know, crashes, but we pretty much have those every day on our interstate. Um, a lot of people who are maybe going a little too fast for the conditions, so I'm sure there have been a few, but we haven't heard of anything major this morning. Cassandra Bajek with the Indiana Department of Transportation. We appreciate this update as we try and get people out the door safely this morning. Thank you. Thank you.